pot disease or pot's disease is a presentation of extrapulmonary tuberculosis whereby disease is seen in the spinal vertebrae. Extrapulmonary tuberculosis can affect the spine, a kind of tuberculous arthritis of the intervertebral joints. It is named after Percival Pott, a British surgeon. The lower thoracic and upper lumbar vertebrae are the areas of the spine most often affected. Scientifically, it is called tuberculous spondylitis and it is most commonly localized in the thoracic portion of the spine. Pot a Euro unregistered trademark S disease results from hematogenous spread of tuberculosis from other sites, often pulmonary. The infection then spreads from two adjacent vertebrae into the adjoining intervertebral disc space. If only one vertebra is affected, the disc is normal, but if two are involved, the disc, which is avascular, cannot receive nutrients and collapses. The disc tissue dies and is broken down by caseation, leading to vertebral narrowing and eventually to vertebral collapse and spinal damage. A dry soft tissue mass often forms and superinfection is rare. Signs and symptoms, back pain, fever, night sweating, anorexia, spinal mass, sometimes associated with numbness, paresthesia, or muscle weakness of the legs, difficulty standing, diagnosis, blood tests, a Euro-CBC, leukocytosis, a Euro-elevated erythrocyte sedimentation rate, 100 mm per hour, tuberculin skin test, a Euro tuberculin skin test results are positive in 84 a Euro 95% of patients with pot disease who are not infected with HIV. Radiographs of the spine, a Euro radiographic changes associated with pot disease present relatively late. The following are radiographic changes characteristic of spinal tuberculosis on plane radiography, lytic destruction of anterior portion of vertebral body, increased anterior wedging, Collapse of vertebral body, reactive sclerosis on a progressive lytic process, enlarged psoas shadow with or without calcification. A euro additional radiographic findings may include the following vertebral end plates are osteoporotic. Intervertebral discs may be shrunk or destroyed. Vertebral bodies show variable degrees of destruction. Fusiform paravertebral shadows suggest abscess formation. Bone lesions may occur at more than one level. Bone scan, CT of the spine, bone biopsy, MRI, late complications, vertebral collapse resulting in kyphosis, spinal cord compression, sinus formation, paraplegia, prevention. Controlling the spread of tuberculosis infection can prevent tuberculous spondylitis and arthritis. Patients who have a positive PPD test may decrease their risk by properly taking medicines to prevent tuberculosis. To effectively treat tuberculosis, it is crucial that patients take their medications exactly as prescribed. Therapy, non-operative are euro antituberculous drugs, analgesics, immobilization of the spine region different types of braces and collars, surgery may be necessary especially to drain spinal abscesses or debride bony lesions fully or to stabilize the spine. A 2007 review found only just two randomized clinical trial with at least one year follow-up found which compared chemotherapy plus surgery with chemotherapy alone for treating people diagnosed with active tuberculosis of the spine. As such there is no high-grade evidence but the results of this study indicates that surgery should not be recommended routinely and clinicians have to selectively judge and decide on which patients to operate. Thoracic spinal fusion with or without instrumentation as a last resort, physical therapy for pain relieving modalities, postural education and teaching a home exercise program for strength and flexibility, cultural references. The Passionists and Gemma Galgani suffered from tuberculosis of the spine. The fictional hunchback of Notre Dame had a gibbous deformity similar to the type caused by tuberculosis. In Henrik Ibsen's play A Doll's House, Dr. Rank suffers from consumption of the spine. Jocelyn, the dean who wanted a spire on his cathedral in William Golding's The Spire probably suffered and died as a result of this disease. English poets Alexander Pope and William Ernest Henley both suffered from Pott's disease. Anna Roosevelt Cowles, sister of President Theodore Roosevelt, suffered from Pott's disease. Chick Webb, swing-era drummer and band leader, was afflicted with tuberculosis of the spine as a child, which left him hunchbacked. 
the Sicilian Mafia boss Luciano Leggio had Potts disease and wore a brace. Morton, the railroad magnate in Once Upon a Time in the West, suffers from the disease and needs crutches to walk. Writer Max Bletcher had Potts disease. Marxist thinker and communist leader Antonio Gramsci suffered from Potts disease, probably due to the bad conditions of his incarceration in fascist Italy during the 1930s. Italian writer, poet and philosopher Giacomo Leopardi suffered from this disease. It features prominently in the book This is a Soul, which chronicles the work of American physician Rick Hodes in Ethiopia. Imogen in the novella The Princess with the Golden Hair Part of Memoirs of Hegate County by Edmund Wilson has Potts disease. Jane Addams, social activist and Nobel Peace Prize winner, had Potts disease. References External links, Pot disease a Euro tuberculous spondylitis, e medicini. Tuberculous arthritis, Medline Plus, USA, Neha. Public domain. Pot disease, Pot's disease of the thoracic spine.